A 7 News My Reporter sending us this photo. Flames engulfing an apartment building in North Glen this morning. Here's another look at that two alarm fire. Eight families left without homes. 7 News reporter Lindsay Sablon talking to one of them. And Lindsay, they were celebrating a birthday when they smelled smoke. And the Robles family was singing happy birthday. They were deciding what flavor cake to make. When they started to feel heat coming from the apartment next door, they quickly ran out of their home that's on the top floor of this unit and watched as their house burned. We were out in the cold. The kids were scared, like our apartment's burning down, and I just knew our apartment's gone. Flames and smoke shooting from a building in the Regatta apartment complex at 9 this morning. Esperanza Robles says she felt heat coming from next door and within minutes, a cloud of smoke. I looked out the window and I seen um, flames and charcoal flying by. Just before that, she and her three children were celebrating. We are making birthday pancakes, singing them happy birthday. Juan turns four today. His big brother tells me. What did your brother say? He said, our, our house burned down on my birthday. Firefighters from North Metro Fire Rescue Thornton and Westminster responding this morning. They worked quickly despite the cold, windy conditions, getting the fire under control in an hour, but it destroyed eight units. Our Christmas presents were in the apartment. Everything that we've worked for was in that apartment. While this family spent the day starting over, Robles' kids keeping it all in perspective, still smiling. Juan just happy he has his Mario outfit. That's all material stuff, but it's still like that's our life is in that apartment, but we have to be thank God that we're all alive and we made it out okay. Now investigators are still trying to determine what caused that fire in the initial apartment. Again, eight people on this end of the building, or excuse me, eight families on this end of the building having to find new homes tonight. The apartment complex actually had enough open apartments to put them up. Meanwhile, the Red Cross provided some food and some clothing and furniture for the families until they're able to get all of that. Again, a lot of the families just telling us they're thankful to be okay, but this is difficult to lose this, especially so close to the holidays. Live in North Glen, Lindsay Sablon, 7 News.